It's just been another one of those soggy, soaking rain shower days filled with thunderstorms too. We've heard a lot of thunder, seen a lot of lightning, and of course, seen our fair share more than our fair share of rain as we just cannot get out from underneath this very soggy weather pattern as a couple of different low pressure systems continue to get closer to the area. And we're seeing a lot of moisture moving up from the south. So those two things combined bringing us the very heavy rain that we've seen throughout the day today. Several multiple flash flood warnings were in existence throughout Kentucky. Most of those from eastern down into southern Kentucky as we saw round after round of showers and thunderstorms just continuing to press through the area. Even a couple of stronger severe thunderstorm warnings issued over around the Louisville area around I-65, but that line dwindled as it started to move east. So we're thankful for that, but we can still anticipate maybe a few more of these heavy downpours as we move throughout the rest of this evening. So don't put the umbrellas away just yet. In fact, keep that around for tomorrow and the beginning part of the work week because we still have this same weather pattern. I can hear some heavy rain and some rumbles of thunder now falling on our roof here on Russell Cave Road. High pressure, a weak high pressure begins to slide up. That's going to help us to get rid of a lot of this rain tonight and early Sunday, but another few rounds of rain is heading our direction as we move into finish up the weekend and move into next work week. So the heaviest of the rain has been falling mainly over into eastern Kentucky. Again, the places that absolutely do not need it between an inch and a half and maybe two inches. There have been some isolated spots that have picked up as much as three inches of rain moving down just south of Somerset, southwestern part of Pulaski County, northern part of Wayne County hit very heavy with some uh, high amounts of rain today. Very, very heavy amounts of rain. And so if can, you can see Lexington picked up about a tenth of an inch. We're receiving more now. Lawrenceburg around two tenths. There were just a few spots that really just didn't see much, but most everyone has seen rain today and over the past two days again same places eastern southern southeastern Kentucky picking up the heaviest amounts of rain again between maybe even two and four inches of rain couple of spots like I just mentioned northern Wayne County even around five inches. These were radar estimated. So again, very heavy rain. Therefore, we still have that flood watch in effect until midnight. After that, things will start to settle down overnight and through portion of your Sunday. But showers return as we move into the hottest part of the day tomorrow in the afternoon. Not quite as hot next week, though. Slightly cooler weather pattern beginning to head our direction as we move closer to the middle point of the month of August. We still have a few days to go before we reach that point. Future track shows scattered showers. The downpours still around as we move throughout this evening. Moving into tonight, we finally start to see the action dwindle. Showers will be fading. Weak high pressure slides in that keeps us mostly dry overnight into your Sunday morning. But then the action gets going again in the hottest part of the afternoon. More of those showers and thunderstorms start to bubble up and fire up. And then we're looking at more of that same kind of situation coming up on Monday. It is muggy outside for the next several days. Cold front, though, eventually brings those dew points down to the low 60s by next weekend as some cooler air starts to work our direction. We will take it. Big Omega block sitting over uh, the upper Ohio Valley and the Great Lakes, and so that's going to be pulling down some more cooler temperatures for us. Tonight, lows down around 70 degrees. We're going to heat up tomorrow. Highs in the upper 80s feeling like the low 90s. It will be a hot one. Scattered showers and storms through the afternoon. Same for Monday, same for Tuesday. More rain on Wednesday than after that. We finally dry out. We'll see some sun and we'll cool off. Highs in the lower 80s.